Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to discuss about swap axis in NumPy. So in the last class we have seen about transposing. But here swap axis. Okay. So transpose is used to exchange rows element into columns elements and columns elements into rows elements. Right. So here uh, for two dimensional for suppose if contain three rows and two columns okay it will exchange so this is two dimensional array right so it will exchange two comma three okay so two comma three if it is three dimensional so two planes three rows and four columns the transpose will do four planes three rows and two columns so it will reverses the entire array okay so this is two dimensional and this is three dimensional so you can exchange you can reverse as the three dimensional array right but here the swap axis function is used to interchange only two axes of an array okay it will exchange only two axes okay so here the syntax is the numpy provides a swap access function it is a swap access function is an inbuilt function in numpy so that's why numpy dot swap access so here three parameters okay it will contain three parameters one is a a means array name and it will swap only two axes okay so in transpose you can exchange the entire array whether it is three dimensional four dimensional or five dimensional so it will reverse as the array but here it is used to swap only two axes so that is axis one and axis two let's see the two dimensional parameters a is required so you need to compulsory you need to give compulsory and it is very mandatory it is used to specify input array okay next it is specify the first axis and it is used to specify the second axis so here if a is any array then a view of a is returned otherwise a new array is created so let's see for two dimensional array so for two dimensional array there is no difference between transpose and swap axis the transpose is used to exchange rows into columns and column elements into rows here swap axis is used to exchange two axes so for two dimensional array it contains only two axes one is rows and another one is columns so here swap axis is used to exchange rows with columns and columns with rows so that's why there is no difference between uh, swap axis and transpose for two dimensional array okay so input numpy as np i am taking 10 elements and 5 comma 2 5 rows and two columns five rows and two columns like this 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 okay so 10 elements 0 to 9 total 10 next i am printing this element so it will print like this next i am applying b is equals to np dot swap axis comma 1 comma 0 so i already said i already told 0 this is 0 this is 1 so swap axis is used to exchange swap to accesses so that's why 0 comma 1 so here 0 comma 1 i am giving first 1 and after that 0 so here 2 rows and 5 columns so 2 is represented 1 and 5 is represented 0 so that's why 0 comma 1 is swapped with 1 comma 0 so here 5 is 0 2 is 1 so exchanged with 0 comma 1 is exchanged with 1 comma 0 okay if you see transpose transpose of a so here transpose of a is used to exchange rows into columns column into rows 5 comma 2 is exchanged with 2 comma 5 like this so here this is the output after swap access okay so there is no difference for two dimensional array let's see the three dimensional array example 
okay so same example i am taking 24 elements so 0 to 23 total 20, uh, number of elements are 24 and i am taking two planes okay two planes so in this two planes i am taking three rows okay three rows and four columns like this three rows and four columns so we already said that i already said that swap axis is used to swap only two planes two axes okay so let's assume this is zero this is one this is two okay so transpose is used to uh, interchange okay so it will reverses like two one zero but this won't act uh, happens in swap axis because swap axis is used to exchange swap only two axes so this is 0 1 2 so here a comma i want to um, i want to apply swap axis on array a and i want to exchange 1 comma 2 so that is 2 is um, 2 is as it is and i am exchanging 4 3 okay so 1 comma 2 i am exchanging 1 comma 2 so 1 place 2 2 plus 1 okay so in the place of 2 it will place the in the place of 3 it will place 4 okay so 2 planes 4 rows 3 columns like this okay so here this is the first output okay so here 2 planes with 3 rows and 4 columns after swap axis two planes four rows and three columns like this okay so you can exchange like this also swap axis of a comma zero comma two okay so i am exchanging these both two comma four so four planes three rows and two columns like this okay three is the same you can swap only two axes okay so you can exchange these two also so for that purpose um, so here 1 comma 0 comma 2 so 2 is as it is 2 is placed on the same place but we are exchanging these two okay so in this way you can use swap access to swap any two access so that is the difference between transpose and swap access so here transpose um, for example if you apply transpose 4 3 2 so here entire shape is exchanged but in swap access you can swap only two access you can exchange these two or these two or these two okay so i hope it is clear if you have any doubts regarding to this video please comment me in the comment section for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you